average wind today in Latvia. There was a bit of a snowstorm yesterday, so plenty of snow. Missed this stuff. Didn't really have snow in England, so it's really nice to be in the snow. But now I've just got to clean it up, clean all the drive um, with the snow shovel here. That's the snow shoveling complete. Probably haven't done the best of jobs, but now it's time to sit down for breakfast. Starving. Pretty done my birthday to spa session in Latvia. Check out our little view outside. Three hours of spa relaxation sessions of massages and other stuff. I don't really know what it entails, but we will find out soon enough. I put, um, a story of it snowing outside here in Latvia. And uh, one of my Latvian friends, they wrote back, she was showing me that she was walking in the snow barefoot. And I was like, what are you doing? And she was just like, oh my God, it's amazing and stuff. So she said, oh yeah, now you can try it. So in the morning, I'm gonna get out on this balcony and I'm gonna give it a go and see how it is. Right, it's time for the barefoot challenge. Oh God. You go first. <laughs> you go first. <laughs> you go first. Ah. Ah. Is it cold? Yeah, it's freezing. Oh my god, so painful. How do you, how long do you do this for? You go back here. <laughs> that wasn't long, babes. So the Latvian breakfast that we have is some kind of omelette, two kinds of sausages, some kind of Latvian fish, but I'm not really sure what it is. Cheese, a variety of smoked meats, and some tomato, orange juice, and a cup of tea with this view. When the baskets are empty, it means you can't enter the shop. So you got to wait for a basket to enter the shop in Latvia. Otherwise, we have to get two trolleys. Just wanted to show how ludicrous it is in these bloody Latvian shops. Got myself a basket now. And uh, to get in, you need to show your vaccine and your ID to get in a supermarket. Also, you come across some retardedly expensive stuff here in Latvia. Like, I was told to pick up some Ben and Jerry's once, so I went to just go and take them, because obviously they're, you know, a few pounds in England, probably like, you can normally get them for like two quid, three quid. Picked up two, two uh, cookie dough ice creams, took them to the till, 18 euros for two ice creams. At that point, I wasn't gonna go, no, but inside me, I was a very sad boy at that point and I didn't really enjoy eating that Ben and Jerry's in the end. Sad, sad story. Look at this, they have a refillable dishwash balm, laundry, cream soap, shower gel, shampoo. Latvia's ahead of the curve. Got some random array of meats. world's smallest watermelon. Let me take you to the bread selection. You can pick up like quarter and half loaves of this brown bread. It's like one euro fifty. But yeah, most of their stuff is like brown or black bread. That's all seeded. Got a selection of trippy meat. Don't know what this is. Basturma. And got this white sausage thing. I don't know if it's the right thing, but I tried something like it and it's pretty lit. Is this the right white sausage? Yes, good. Good one. Ah, oh, no. No? no. This is the right one by Remy. 
This is a lot more softer. Uh -oh. And what's this stuff here? Basturma. It's like beef. Can't go wrong with some tortillas. Oh mate, these are absolutely fire. I love these. Got some different flavours. Christiana loves the caramel one. See, I swear this is like expensive. 455 for some oat milk. That can't be normal, can it? Ben and Jerry's. Eight euros. This is what I'm talking about. Eight euros for one of these. Ah, the good old Riga Black. This is really good, man, the current. Yeah. They make hot drinks out of this in the winter. Nice alcoholic drink can make like a mulled wine kind of type thing yeah ready to go only 50 euros for two small bags that are pretty much empty and bearing in mind Latvian people don't really earn that much money probably half the average UK wage. Crazy. Yeah, looks like Latvia was hit pretty hard with the inflation over the last few months. But it's been quite expensive anyway, which is very strange. Don't really know how people live in this country, if I'm honest. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed the Latvian shopping trip. Because we didn't. <laughs> 60 euros for eggs. Oh, that was a shopping that just fell over. Mm. Ooh, 60 euros that? for bread, eggs, and and uh, a few potatoes. Right, that's it. Shopping done. Time to get cooking. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And see you next time. Bye. Bye.